Don't let it get to you. Use the scepter. Watch out. No. Oh wow, uh, hi, okay, it is night time apparently, what was I doing? Oh, oh yeah, I think I remember, wow, um, what in the world? Okay, I see a couple of creepers there, and uh, uh, I'm not going to get close, okay, I see a lot of things developing there, what is going on? What? Where am I? What world is this? Well, I seem to be in our good old world, but for some reason everything looks so white and uh, 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 and different. This is Omnis Lama, I know. Is that a pig swimming down there? I don't think so. What the? Okay. I'm pretty sure this used to be blue. Where? What did it warp into now? These are like they used to be. This is the dank plank, as usually. This is new. I wonder where it takes to. Okay, I have been turning here for a long time. What? This is like a new area. Hello, parking lot here? Well, that could be cool, so I can park my elytra. Bad omen? I don't know what is going on here. Look at these guys. What? Wha okay. Oh, my shop is, is still there, but I need to build a road to it. I think I'm going to talk to other people about it and build a road to this shop so it's not just here apart from everything. And look at that. TP and... Yeah. I haven't checked in my shop for a long time. I wonder if I have some orders. Okay, books seem to be all right. Let's see, take books from here. Some books have been... Oh, look at this. I have three things to take care of. Oh man, um, great horns. Oh, I have, be I have been selling some goat horns. Cool. So I got some ripcoin on my hands. Finally. Um, Oh, and also, I have been noting that some people, when they take their uh, weather roads, they, they also leave a tip. No, I don't want to punch you, I want to grab that. That was not necessary. Uh, weather roads were totally for free because that's a community service, but if anybody is willing to leave a little donation, I, would, I don't mind that. I'm just going to take them. It has been hot uh, lately. I don't think I'm going to be using my trench coat for some time now. I'm just going to hang it here. That feels better. Now let's read what this is about. This is Wandering Souls. Uh, hello Winters, some time ago I received some magic crystals from some of the forest fees and I was wondering if you could combine them with my trident. I will try to do it myself but I don't have much knowledge on how to use magic or combine something with magic when you're f uh, when you're free, let me know and I can give you the trident and crystals and maybe try some few Some fees to you as, as well Fee, what are these? Uh, I need to research on this Souls, alright, so souls needs some trident work Now let's see um, This is from uh, Quiddles I don't know if you know, but I have not been feeling la well lately This is due to a rash 
on my left shoulder that keeps expanding at high, high pace. I was maybe wondering if you could come up with something that will stop the rash from growing and while you're at it you could make something that protects some more overall. 1, 1, 2, 112 deaths! Oh my god! Please let me know when you have finished this cause this thing is freaking me out! Squiddles! Okay, Squiddles, I'm going to check that out. Uh, let's see. And this one, I think, is from Jimbo, yeah? I was hoping you will have time to make an order for me. I need some shades. Is there any way you could get your hands on some pairs of sunglasses for me? My employees need to be uniform for the opening of the nightclub, and also shades will be great to hand out for souvenirs, as well as I will pay you good in Ripcoin for your time. Thank you, Jimbo. Wow! So I got so much work to do. And uh, I need to do it fast because people have been waiting for this for a long time. Uh, also, I have some requests from Sir Mickey uh, that he he told me about a lightsaber. Um, I think I know something about that. And also, Dots asked for a shield. But yeah, oh man, time to get working. So, I just entered my house. And... Apparently my diamond farm is working. Okay, I opened the gate. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure I only had one of these. For some reason, diamonds are growing. Anyways, I was coming here because I'm full of shulker boxes at the moment. What I need to do is... I'm still working on the chicken dungeon game. I need to refill armor parts. Before I get to work on my requests i'm going to try to get some banners to make some shields i should have a bunch of wool here there we go yeah so i'm going to make some sticks get some banners done fill the boxes like this these are empty then go there and put some armor shields and weapons for anyone who's going to play the chicken dungeon game this chicken game is really taking a lot of time to prepare I'm gathering all of the loot, this is my prime matter to make some uh, interesting tools and weapons I'm going to be providing as a prize all is for those demon feathers that I really need to continue uh, what would I needed them for? oh yeah okay first of all I really enjoy how the world looks with this uh, head the enderman skull but I think I'm going to need to use it for something else this skull has an energy core inside and I guess I'm going to use it so let's take this off okay okay uh, I didn't remember how everything looked without it <laughs> let's take all of this loot inside here before getting it ready I think I need to set up an area here when I when I arrived initially to this place, I created this with a piece of metal that I found down there. So I'm just gonna grab it. And I think uh, I can hold the energy core this ender skull has inside. I can hold it uh, with this so I can harness this power and use it to create uh, a little bit more of a powerful tools. So this area is this area is a bit empty right now it was left empty intentionally because i need to build stuff here um, and i think the space is going to be good enough i'm going to start designing i'm going to grab my blueprints and i'm going to uh, think about something i can make a proper workshop for these uh, matters this is going to be turned into a great place for inventions let's get my hands on it
and it's done. I made the workshop and I managed to replicate the ender core. I found a way to use the ender head to replicate the energy and uh, holding and ironing it and then the energy started passing to the ironing it until it turned into another like mini core. With the iron holder I can stabilize the energy that goes from here to here. I think this is a stable now. It's a nice source of power I can use to infuse some tools on this area. Speaking of that, I have work to do. I got a wrench. Look at this fence. It's not connected to the wall thanks to this. I got some tools here. I'm going to use these tools to upgrade them. These are just diamond tools, not netherite because that'll be a lot of netherite I need to use. Uh, I don't have that many ingots. I have a few, but not that many. For the chicken game, I'm going to design a sword perhaps. I think I can make a plasma sword out of that. A plasma sword uh, book. And I'm going to add some enchants to it perhaps. Uh, for sure sharpness. Uh, sweeping edge. Looting. Okay, that consumes some levels. Like that. And I have the blueprint for the plasma sword. Now let's take a sword and make the specifications of the blueprint on this sword. Make it according to the design. Okay. Wow. Wow, this sword looks cool. Let's take a look at it. That's a nice sword for a price. Now I need some interesting glasses for Jimbo. Okay, let's see about this. Uh, I need uh, something to put them on. Yeah, using a pumpkin, I can just do that and make the shape to get them. I got them. Oh my god. This looks great. <laughs> I need to deliver some of this to Jimbo. I now got Jimbo's order complete and I want to go to deliver that to him. Here is a shipment of sunglasses one special for him with uh, extra protection uh, i got some delivery notes so uh, i am uh, excusing myself uh, for the delay explaining what the order contains and also the invoice for him to go to jimbo's i think i remember uh, where his base is but the easiest way to get there i guess go to heaven and uh, to go to heaven i need to set my spawn here and uh, break the bed and now i need something to get rid of me okay that was easy i'm in heaven okay <laughs> wow i hope they got ender chests on heaven hello uh, Mr. Oh, oh yes. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, that is peaceful. Oh, they have beds here. Nice. Uh, now my stuff should be just here. Uh, now this is not Jimbo's base, of course, but his base, I think, is just down the stairway. And oh, okay. So, down here, I see the world appearing, I'm hoping Jimbo at some point sees the box around, there's a panda in there, okay, and we're here, I need to deliver something to Jimbo, anybody can attend me, what about you, oh, these guys are just chilling here, why do you put your arms up, Pablo? Oh. Hello? You're sleeping. And I'm just going more down and down. Okay, nether portal. That's it. I'm just going to put it here. This seems like uh, an area where Jimbo will just hang out. So I'm just going to put that there. And wow, okay. Tree farms and a lot of things. Jimbo's base is great. Now I want to continue the design with these plasma weapons. And uh, now that I can get uh, the 
I can harness the energy from the Ender Skull. Uh, these plasma wow. tools are uh, very useful because the plasma produced by the engine can easily cut through materials. I want to try a plasma axe design. So I'll just grab the axe here. Now, in order to make it, I want to to have it so that we can maybe maybe having haste to can help to insta mine logs perhaps but if i want to do that i need more than regular efficiency so uh in to get a better efficiency enchant thanks to the ender energy um i guess i can just use some of my experience to combine this all right uh Efficiency 6? Not bad. Wow, that took 20 levels. Now, working on the blueprint, I'm going to apply that efficiency. And uh, sharpness, why not? A sharp axe will be better. I'm breaking. And mending. But I don't have enough levels. Oh, that's good enough for that. And now let's see. This this will make a good axe, so I'm just going to uh, craft the axe. All right. This this looks very nice. I want to take a better look look at that. That's a nice design for axe. Yes. So I'm going to continue with the other tools, perhaps. Maybe having a pickaxe that could insta mine deep slate with haste too. Ah, this is going to require a lot of experience. Perhaps I need to build some sort of a XP shower. I don't know if I would have enough uh, bottles for that. I finally got all the experience necessary for completing all of the remaining blueprints for these tools here. So I'm going to quickly just make them all. Then I'm going to make a few uh, sets of this so I can go and put them as a prize for the chicken game and finally open that for the replay to, to play. I got the blueprint here which should be effective enough to insta mine deep slate when you have haste 2. Now let's try that. Okay, so this also looks like a nice design. It looks better so shovel will be ready and for last it's going to be the hoe and this looks like like that okay souls thanks for coming i i just called you moments ago uh i need a job um so okay. if, if you follow me here so this is the chicken game you're going to enter here fight chickens that are going to be like uh, a little bit overpowered and if you complete the challenge you're going to come out here on this exit and I have been trying to figure out how to build something uh, to like uh, get the player out from here uh, because there's this game and there this like this is a hole uh, so you basically come out on this area here and uh, I need an easy way out. So what I thought is to make like uh, some sort of a willow tree that is like uh, growing on the side of, of this part here of this cliff. And the roots are hanging and there's like vines hanging from there so you can climb down, down the vines and get out of the area. Ooh, that's a good idea. Yeah. So... What kind of vines? Like the normal vines? Or no, the yeah, like those. Vines? No, can you climb on, on the glowberries? Yeah, you can climb the glowberries. Okay, so it could, it could be a mix of, the, of both. Use these ones and, and the glowberries, and uh, it, they could be mixed, and that way um, it'll look very cool. And of course, uh, keep a little touch to the area here. There's a pool down here that could be like improved so, uh, somehow. I can make a little waterfall going from oh. uh, about to there all the way down there, making it seem like water's coming out from the ground and just... Uh, puddling down here into a pond. Yeah, there are like a couple of axolotls living down here if they're still alive. Oh, really? Uh, maybe just one? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, they're still there. Oh. One of them's there. 
Yeah, <laughs> one of them. <laughs> so maybe uh, a bucket. A bucket. I if surely you put have. Them in a bucket and rename them. They'll keep the name. Oh, that's very cool. Uh, so what name should I should I put to this guy? Fudge. There we go. Name him Fudge. Uh, Budge. Fudge. Fudge. Uh, Fudge, because it's yeah. <laughs> the color. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to do and that. It's the name of my first axolotl I have. My oh, nice. Rival. Okay. So what kind? What color do you want the weeping uh, willow? Do you want it to be like oak, spruce, darkwood? It's your choice. Make it uh, look good with the blue build I have here. Whatever it takes for that. Uh, okay. So it's it's all your decision. That's that's the only the only requirement is that it allows the player to go up in a nice way, and that's it. All the rest is up to you. And of course, you let me know the price. I generally don't remember my pricings. I think uh -huh. it was like ten rep coins for like a large tree. Okay. Uh, so if this is large, I can uh, actually pay you in advance. Oh, nice. Right there. Thank you. Okay. So, I'll gather up the stuff needed and I'll get started on a tree as soon as I can. Alright, that'll be fine, thanks! Souls did her job now. This is now ready. I have placed some books to put information about how to collect uh, the loot. Everyone should collect only one tool they, they should choose among the one they like the most. They can do the run again, of course, if they want. So there's three of each on these uh, shulker boxes that's all i could make for now and i think uh, if this runs off i'm going to work on a different set of tools perhaps uh, with different qualities every tool has a description of what the tool does why are they made like this we have the axe the pickaxe the shovel sword and the hoe I don't know why the how I like it the most. And at the end, a final thank you for the ones who participated and made it to this way because it is not easy. That is very, very difficult. So pushing the button, you can come out here and here's Soul's work. She worked on this tree and it's very, very nice. Uh, so the way to get out is just by climbing the vines, coming to this log here, this log made of logs. And we're out. I really loved her job. That's that's very nice. And finally, the one thing remaining to do here is to declare this open. So there's an explanation book here uh, with how to proceed. So basically, it's just follow the signs, set spawn, uh, put stuff on the chest, get equipment here from the dispensers, and of course, right click this block to uh, reset everything. Uh, and then go through the pens in order one by one killing the chicken collecting the fire feathers and putting in the offering a dropper under each of these statues and at the end just collect the prices uh, that's the basic work so i'm just going to remove this and this is now open so i'm going to put a message for everyone to see so they can come here and uh, play i was initially planning to have like a, a fee a payment to get like for about five ten rip coins but since i'm going to be getting some fire feathers that i need i'm just going to put it free for donations to anyone who just want to give whatever they want it could be rip coin or anything else for now this is open